Mimi Leakes claims she's faced professional repercussions for standing up for herself amid conditions she described as discriminatory on The Real Housewives of Atlanta. Leakes, 54, spoke Monday with TMZ in Los Angeles about the lawsuit she filed last month against Real Housewives executive producer Andy Cohen, 53, Bravo and NBC Universal, as she claimed they oversaw a hostile and racist workplace. Yes, I've been blacklisted, when you haven't worked in three years when all of a sudden you're working and sought after, and suddenly you're not working, it's being blacklisted, Leakes said. I haven't caused any problems on any set, everybody I've ever worked with I had a good working relationship with, except for this group of people. Leaks, who is black, also named True Entertainment and Truly Original, as well as executives from the companies, in her suit filed in Atlanta Federal Court, according to the Associated Press. She said that she was punished for reporting hearing racist remarks from white RHOA co-star Kim Zolkiak Bierman, 43, to higher ups with the companies. The reality star, whose full name is Linithia Monique Leakes, told TMZ on Monday that the goal of the lawsuit is to stop discrimination against black women. Nobody wants to go to work every day as a black woman with blonde hair and the head of the corporation calls you a white woman. She continued, a white man shouldn't say to a black woman, you're a white woman because you're wearing your hair blonde, as if it belongs to a certain ethnic group, to a certain people, that's not right. And it's just more than that, it's discrimination. When asked about the timing of the, the lawsuit, which she filed last month, Leakes said it was the result of years of professional sabotage against her that paved the path to the courtroom. I felt like it was the right time a couple years ago, a few years ago, but I was constantly being retaliated against, being blacklisted, not able to work, being silenced and so, you know it was difficult to do, she said. Leakes said online speculation that she filed the suit because she was not able to get her own show was so small, so ridiculous and doesn't make any sense. We're talking about discrimination, we're not talking about a show, she said. It has nothing to do with having a temper tantrum and wanting a show, I never wanted my own show, I had many opportunities to have one, I did, that's not it, it's discrimination, that's what it is.